Well, I have three items I want to visit with you about this evening. Uh, the first of these is an upcoming project that uh, will take a while, and it's a major one, so we want to make sure people are aware of it in advance. That is the 33rd and Broadway intersection improvements. Uh, last week, ODOT awarded a contract for, then this is a state project, of course, but they awarded a contract to Allen Contracting for about $5.4 million. Uh, the city share, the 20% uh, share of that construction is about 1.1 million. Uh, the construction will start uh, sometime in the next several months. It really depends on ODOT's schedule, and it'll take at least a year to complete. Uh, the project will include additional westbound to southbound left turn lanes, dual southbound to eastbound left turn lanes, in single westbound and eastbound right turn lanes as well. Um, a median will be installed uh, on 33rd Street east of Broadway, and that area will be widened as well. Uh, we hope to get that project started roughly in, in the June time frame, but uh, we just want to start alerting people now that uh, this project will be a major inconvenience for traffic. I think everyone can understand that. So what we're saying is if you don't have to go near 33rd and Broadway, don't go there. Uh, and if you have alternate routes, be thinking about those now. But uh, this will be a year of major inconvenience in that area. Uh, we're sorry about that, but we obviously need the additional turn lanes. So uh, hopefully the more we say that, the more people will develop alternative routes and we can go from there. The second project is the Colville widening from Fairfax Lane to I-35. Uh, our engineering staff has begun uh, the utility coordination meetings that are needed with the various utilities in advance of the project. Uh, we expect to receive those in the next three to four months, and as our people review those and approve those, then uh, we'll be able to uh, actually move forward with the relocations. We hope to have those take place sometime in the next, what, Steve, starting in the next four to five months probably. Uh, and all those will need to be done, obviously, in advance of when the actual road widening work starts, which will start after the relocations. Uh, just as a reminder, the uh, estimated cost of the project is about $10 million, and ODOT will be providing about half of that cost. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then the third area is sales tax. Uh, the monthly report is, again, an encouraging one. Uh, we now have our 10th check of the current fiscal year, uh, and for the year, we are cumulatively now about 4.9% above last year's revised or actuals uh, and that's an increase from the month before when our cumulative percentage was 4.6 so we've gone up three tenths of a percent as, as you know with a detailed breakdown of the numbers they continue to be very very positive and, and we're very fortunate that the numbers continue to move in the right direction so with that mr. mayor that concludes my report and I'll be happy to answer any questions you might have